All right, Coach Peter over here, guys. Um, I want to chat today quickly just about open stance uh, on the forehand and the backhand. And before we get started, I think a lot of players get confused about when should I hit open stance, when should I hit closed stance. And uh, I just want to make it very basic for you to understand. For me, the best way to remember is any difficult shot, wide shot, hard shot, deep shot, open stance. Okay? Any easy shot, uh, slow shot, short ball, down the line, you use close stance. Now obviously there, if you look at the pros, they sometimes hit open stance when you would think it should be close stance, and sometimes they hit close stance when you would think it's open stance, but they're always on balance, but those are just the basics. And then coming back to uh, the open stance, guys, uh, what's very important is, um, is your balance. One mistake I often see players make is they go for the open stance. As they hit the ball, they're already stepping. And then, you know, you lose the whole benefit of going open stance. I, wanna, I want you to focus a little bit next time you do open stance. You hit open stance and you stay on that outside leg. I'll tell you why not. Because if you go open stance and you stay on that open stance with balance, it's a lot easier for you to cross over and back to the middle another reason why it's so important if you go hit the ball open stance and then step over now after that you have to step out and then get back it takes so much longer okay let me show you quickly how quickly you can recover uh, if you go open stance one cross over and shuffle back okay so you go there it's a lot quicker back but if you go like this hit out and so it takes so much longer okay guys so i'm going to give you Four demos quickly and you'll see uh, first of all will be normal pace the last four will be slow motion take a look at my feet take a look at how I stay on my outside leg and how I recover Let's go one more 